Ha ha. Hmm. All right, let's go. What is this place? Torch. This part of the wreckage must have reached a natural cavity. Wow, that's ghastly. There's a key, but I'm hearing footsteps. Bartoli's men are more numerous than expected. Don't try it! Very well, he hasn't underestimated my power. My torch is being attacked by a barracuda. Hold on! Saved. Let's go get the key. It's a good start. Uh -huh. This key will be a fine addition to my collection. Camera, please focus. Incredible, it's not just a ship, but a liner. Given the height of the hull, it was one of the largest. If this barracuda found a way through, I'll find it too. It was a breeze. I found a propeller. Don't interrupt me. I was about to give more details about the propellers. An impressive underwater cavern with breathable air. How was it formed? This mafioso is trying to project onto me a flammable mixture of petroleum jelly and benzene. That's an illegal use of napalm. Another propeller. I wonder if a small propeller is called a rookie peller or a hobbyist peller. Boulder-free slopes are becoming almost abnormal in my expeditions. Lucky that the crash created this opening. Hey, why can't I squeeze through here? These chocolates might not have been good for my waistline. <laughs> Strange. There must be an invisible wall. Oh, the lock is there. That was quicker than I had anticipated. I'm being surprised at every turn. No. Darn, it's not the right key. Without a metal detector, it's going to take me a while to find it. Camera, help me look for the key, please. Excuse me, sir. Do you know where I can find a key? This mute man seems petrified. He snapped out of his stupor. Stop! You're going to end up burning someone!
Next time, he'll read the 1977 Geneva Protocol more carefully. I've already seen this kind of hatch before. It's a trap. Torch. Hmm. I can't jump that high. Why do I never have my grappling hook when I need it? I could fashion a rope with my hair and clothing, but I hate ropes. It's coarse and rough and irritating, and it gets knots everywhere. I can move this crate. Focus. Push, push. <coughs> wow, it's flashing. Blimey, that's not cool. Why can't I grab onto this ledge? Should I force my way through? All right, it seems these blocks can still be moved. All this for a pack of cigarettes. Uh -huh. What am I saying? Those are torches. Fascinating. These doors always work. Easy. It's slippery. A deadly fall can happen so quickly. Is the Seraph underwater? Torch. It's cold! Great. I've opened the passage. But why is the music sad? Is it a bad sign? Yay, Bubbles! I can't move this block in an aquatic environment. I recognize that man. He's dangerous. He should remain unconscious for a while. Uh -huh. Ouch, lucky my body absorbed the impact.
I know where this block is located. Thank you, Brain. Caution. It's neither the time nor the place to break a leg. In rusted wreck, an adventurer I roam, seeking hidden artifact, I brave alone. Through corridors of decay I boldly tread, in search of treasures where secrets are spread. It's suddenly dark. And torture. Go, go, Power Ranger, go. There's a water current nearby. <sighs> Liet. Wow, what a lovely cave. They've even set up an inflatable boat for a tour. What a thoughtful gesture. Oh no, I can't climb aboard from here. The sea folk are back. I'm not much of a Baroque fan. I prefer classical music. These scissors are a hazard too significant to be overlooked. Uh -huh. The key is there. How to reach it? There's an opening in the ceiling. This seaman wants a bubble battle. He lost. I'm a bubble expert after all. Someone dropped a figurine in the water. What a shame. Where do I go now? Let's follow the light. Drying mode. On. My wetsuit is now dry. This tunnel is a good start. 
The absence of stalactites suggests it's man-made, or that Bartoli's men drained the water. I believe it's sedimentary rock, ideal for discovering fossils. This humanoid creature is not a fossil. Fossils cannot be killed. Uh -huh. Yeah, shotgun ammo! Lumos. After some thought, this rock could be Gabbro, a plutonic rock with a coarse-grained texture, primarily composed of pyroxene and feldspar. It is the main constituent of the lower layer of the oceanic crust. It's also found on the surface of the moon, and it's also a good substrate for corals, which is rather cool. But not as cool as a medipack! Uh -huh. This isn't safe, but it's the only path. Ouch. I've got the key. Uh -huh. Excellent. Uh -huh. Chopsticks are preferable to forks on inflatable boats. <laughs> the corpses of the sea folk attracted a shark. It shouldn't bother with me then. These fish can smell a drop of blood in a swimming pool. I can do the same with chocolate. It's okay. This gangster will wake up with a serious backache. <laughs> I'm hungry. Should I eat the shark? Let's try the other path. Hmm, parkour. I heard a spooky noise. I thought it was Winston. I've reached the deck. It's the horizontal platform located above the hull where you often find crew quarters, control stations, passenger cabins, and other facilities. It's the area where the crew works, and passengers typically stroll to enjoy the view. I hear footsteps approaching. Anyone who attacks from behind deserves no mercy. You'll think about your actions, boy! Hmm. Why am I so aggressive? I won't touch that disgusting handle. Oh my gosh, what a discovery! Look at this bench! It's remarkably well preserved. I must be in first class. Too bad Winston's not here to see this.
Wow, there's too much to describe, but it's grand. Waffles! The absence of bats suggests there's no way out to the surface. The sinking must have been so swift that people didn't have time to use this life buoy. I need to gain some altitude to see if I spot anything shiny below. This chimney didn't withstand the impact. I still need to figure out how the boat managed to reach this cavern without water flooding in. Hey, is there anyone around here? Pardon me if that was your way of saying hello. This is my torch. Chocolate bars! Uh -huh. Double pack, great! This door opened by itself. It can't be a draft. No problem. A ghost resorting to making jokes like that surely isn't a threat. The door has opened. I see. The ghost wanted to warn me. I'm out of bullets. Where was the door with the dirty handle again? Oh, splendid, a lock. More cheese graters. Uh -huh. Metals can be exchanged for money. Torch. Torch! This floor doesn't look stable. The two corpses on the ground are a clue to where the door is. That's a good way to know where I've been. How many assassination attempts must I endure? They'll eventually realize it's not working. The problem is if they all perish, they don't have the time to tell the others who I am. It's an evolving ditch which can only lead to their extinction. Nature is brutal.
There's nothing here. My eyes have adjusted to the darkness. All the keys look the same on this ship. Uh -huh. What a view! It reminds me of my expedition to Peru, with a few less mountains and less snow too. Actually, it doesn't resemble Peru at all. I haven't explored this opening yet. Nice strutter. We can admire the water infiltration into the rock. Camera, take a snapshot of this wall, please. I'll come back later to dig here. An imminent danger is approaching. They have mountaineering boots with studs. These twins almost stabbed me in the back. Shame, it's not my size. Darn. This medipack has slipped into a hard-to-reach place. Uh -huh. I'm not afraid. I've read Journey to the Center of the Earth. What's that sound? Jumanji's chest? Hello there. It looks like a trap. I won't fall for it. I should have been more discreet now they're waiting for me. And they have bigger torches. Hmm. The Seraph could be anywhere. <coughs> One day I got lost in a pyramid, infested with flying mutants. Since then I avoid moving forward without taking a landmark. Oh, and the pyramid ended up exploding. Naturally. <coughs> I haven't explored this place yet.
How do I get down? I doubt the lifts are still operational. I could jump into the pool with this boy. That would be fun. Sorry, I don't need assistance to descend. Cheese graters, what are they doing here? Uh -huh. What am I doing here? The Seraph. The Seraph was on the boat during the shipwreck. Hmm. There's a door in this swimming pool. Excuse me, I'm busy. Was the Barracuda placed there, or did it get stuck because they drained the water? Hmm. This criminal has deceived my vigilance. I must be wary. Oh no, an ambush. Problem solved. Yay! A secret! These scissors will come in handy if I run out of ammunition. The third class are here. They don't have benches. Poor unfortunate souls. <coughs> wow. Thanks to the camera for this cinematic shot. I'll deal with these arsonists later. <clears throat> uh -huh. That's a lot of diving goggles. A pyromaniac doesn't belong underwater. He ended up burning himself. There is an item there. Uh -huh. Upon my return, I'll open a shop selling diving goggles. There's still a sniper lurking on that platform. One less murderer on this earth. I can't take this flamethrower, too bad. 
It's a slide. Pocahontas! <laughs> it was awesome. Oh no, another wizard. He was weak. I was strong. If this isn't the right key, I'll resort to more brute methods. I'm not going to die of famine here just because a door refuses to open. Torch. Wow, how mysterious. If that's not the Seraph, I don't know what it is. Caution. Artifacts are often protected by enchantments. Uh -huh. Oh yo 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 y